The world is in constant motion, nothing stays the same. This is the essence of muju, a Japanese word that translates to impermanence. It's a concept deeply woven into the fabric of Japanese philosophy and culture. Muju reminds us that change is the only constant. It is the natural order of the universe. Muju is often linked to Buddhist teachings, particularly the concept of anika. Anika emphasizes the transient nature of all phenomena. Everything is in a state of flux. This includes our thoughts, emotions, possessions, and even our physical bodies. Understanding Muju is not about dwelling on loss or fearing the future. Instead, it's about embracing the ever-changing nature of reality. It's about finding peace and even liberation in the flow of life. Imagine a river. It flows continuously, never stopping, never the same from one moment to the next. Muju is like the river, always moving, always evolving. In Japan, the cherry blossom season is a powerful symbol of Muju. The blossoms are exquisite in their beauty, yet their time is fleeting. They bloom briefly, then scatter with the wind. The cherry blossom reminds us that even the most beautiful moments in life are temporary. This awareness can be bittersweet. It can make us cherish these moments even more deeply. We often cling to things we find pleasurable. We resist change, especially when it brings discomfort or sorrow. But Muju teaches us that both joy and sorrow are transient. They are like waves rising and falling in the ocean of existence. By accepting the impermanent nature of all experiences, we can find a sense of peace, even in challenging times. We learn to ride the waves of life with greater equanimity. We appreciate the highs and navigate the lows with greater resilience. Embracing impermanence is not about becoming passive or detached. It's about living more fully in each moment. When we let go of our attachment to permanence, we open ourselves up to a world of possibilities. Muju frees us from the illusion of control. It allows us to be more present and adaptable to life's unexpected turns. It teaches us to appreciate the beauty in every experience, whether it's a moment of joy or a period of difficulty. Think of a beautiful sunset. Its colors shift and fade with each passing minute, yet its beauty is no less breathtaking because it is temporary. In fact, its fleeting nature makes it all the more precious. Incorporating Muju into daily life doesn't require drastic changes. It's about subtle shifts in perspective and awareness. Here are some ways to start. Pay attention to the present moment without judgment. Notice the sights, sounds, and sensations around you. Take time each day to appreciate the good things in your life no matter how small. Instead of resisting change, try to approach it with curiosity and an open mind. Recognize that material possessions, relationships, and even your own thoughts and emotions are in a constant state of flux. By incorporating these practices into your daily routine, you can begin to experience the liberating power of Muju. You can find joy and peace in the midst of life's ever-changing landscape. Section 5, Cultivating Mindfulness. Awakening to the present moment. Mindfulness is the practice of paying attention to the present moment without judgment. It's about becoming aware of our thoughts, feelings, and sensations without getting carried away by them. Mindfulness is a powerful tool for embracing impermanence. When we practice mindfulness, we begin to notice the ever-changing nature of our experiences. We see that thoughts come and go like clouds in the sky. Emotions rise and fall like waves in the ocean. Sensations arise and dissolve, constantly shifting and changing. This awareness helps us to detach from our thoughts and feelings. We learn to observe them without getting caught up in them. This allows us to experience life with greater clarity, peace, and acceptance. Try practicing mindfulness during everyday activities. Pay attention to the sensations of your breath as you inhale and exhale. Notice the taste and texture of your food as you eat. Pay attention to the feeling of your feet on the ground as you walk. These simple acts of awareness can help you to connect with the present moment and cultivate a deeper appreciation for the impermanent nature of experience. Section 6. The Art of Acceptance Embracing Change with Grace Resistance to change is a natural human tendency. We crave stability and predictability, but the reality is that life is full of surprises. Change is inevitable. Acceptance doesn't mean giving up or resigning ourselves to unpleasant situations. It means acknowledging reality as it is, without judgment or resistance. 
It means embracing the ebb and flow of life, the good and the bad, the easy and the difficult. When we resist change, we create suffering for ourselves. We hold on to things that are no longer serving us. We dwell on the past or worry about the future, missing out on the beauty of the present moment. Embracing change, on the other hand, allows us to move through life with greater ease and grace. It allows us to adapt to new situations, learn from our experiences, and grow as individuals. Section 7. Gratitude Finding Joy in the Ephemeral Gratitude is a powerful antidote to the fear and anxiety that can arise from our awareness of impermanence. When we focus on what we are grateful for, we shift our attention away from what we lack or what we fear losing. Gratitude helps us to appreciate the good things in our lives, no matter how small or fleeting they may be. It allows us to find joy in the present moment, even in the midst of difficult circumstances. Take some time each day to reflect on the things you are grateful for. It could be something as simple as a warm sunny day, a delicious meal, or a kind word from a friend. Write down your blessings in a gratitude journal. Share your gratitude with others. The more you practice gratitude, the more you will find to be grateful for. Gratitude is like a muscle. The more you use it, the stronger it becomes. Section 8. The Power of Letting Go Releasing Attachments Attachment is a major source of suffering. We become attached to people, possessions, ideas, and even our own identities. We cling to the things that bring us pleasure and security, and we resist anything that threatens our sense of self. The problem is, everything is impermanent. People change, possessions break or get lost, ideas evolve, and even our own bodies and minds are in a constant state of flux. When we cling too tightly to anything, we set ourselves up for disappointment and suffering. Letting go doesn't mean we don't care. It means we care enough to allow things to be as they are. It means accepting that change is inevitable and that clinging only creates more suffering. Practice letting go in small ways each day. Notice when you are holding on to a grudge, a worry, or desire. Take a deep breath and allow yourself to release your grip. Section 9. Reflection and Growth. Learning from impermanence. Impermanence is not something to be feared. It is an opportunity for growth and transformation. By reflecting on the ever-changing nature of our experiences, we gain valuable insights into ourselves and the world around us. Journaling can be a helpful tool for reflection. Take some time each day to write about your experiences, your thoughts, and your feelings. What have you learned from your experiences? How have you changed over time? What are you grateful for? What challenges have you faced and how have you overcome them? Meditation is another powerful practice for cultivating self-awareness and reflection. By quieting the mind and observing our thoughts and emotions without judgment, we can develop a deeper understanding of ourselves and our place in the world. Section 10. Adaptability. Navigating life's changing tides. The only constant is change. This is why adaptability is essential for navigating life's ups and downs. When we are adaptable, we are able to adjust to new situations, embrace new opportunities, and overcome challenges with greater ease. Adaptability doesn't mean we have to like or agree with every change that comes our way. It simply means we are willing to adjust our sails, to be flexible in our thinking and our approach. Cultivate adaptability by stepping outside of your comfort zone regularly. Try new things, meet new people, and expose yourself to new ideas. The more you push yourself to adapt, the more resilient and resourceful you will become. Section 11. Embracing the beauty of Naomuju's gift. Muju is not a morbid concept. It is a profound invitation to live more fully in the present moment. By recognizing the impermanence of all things, we can appreciate the preciousness of each breath, each experience, each encounter. When we let go of our attachment to permanence, we open ourselves up to a world of beauty and wonder. We see the world through fresh eyes, appreciating the simple joys and finding meaning in the midst of life's challenges. Muju is a gift. It is a reminder to live each day to the fullest, to cherish the moments we have, and to embrace the ever-changing flow of existence. Let us live with open hearts, curious minds, and a deep appreciation for the beauty of now. The cherry blossoms will bloom again, but each spring is unique, each moment a fleeting masterpiece.